does not spell wrong. That's how I spell guinea pig. Just, just saying. Thank you. Now, allow me to explain. I am a scientist in charge of social media studies and the effects that social media has on people. I thoroughly believe that we are all being controlled by social media and this is just one of my many experiments. So Whenever you watch a YouTube video, you have, without knowledge, been clickbaited, which, as we all know, causes extreme amounts of brain rot, which is a phrase that I, myself, actually coined. Now, I have a few questions to ask you. I need you to answer honestly. This video is the same as the four videos that are currently up. They've all been released at the same time. They all have the same description, the same timestamps, the same titles. Everything's the same except the thumbnail. That's the only difference. And from this, we will study the analytics of um, watch time uh, when someone has been lied to with a different thumbnail than what is actually in the video. We will find out what people's curiosity is with a video that says the, um, you, the YouTube has deleted this video. And uh, the effect between the difference of a, a woman and a man on the thumbnail and also the strangeness of why you would want to click on a video with an axe wielding alien. So which one did you click on? There are four in total. There is the female And there is the, uh, um, the YouTube has deleted this video. Which one did you click on? Okay. And why did you click on that video? Okay. Do you often click on videos like that? Specified. Now this is asking me to write down your name, but um, you're to me, you're just guinea pig. So I'm just going to write guinea pig number 75 with 76. your motivation? Was it the curiosity? Was it... Oh, okay. Uh, the more detail the better, if you could. This really helps with my research, you see. shape it is. 
is this. Yep, that is correct. Okay. What shape is this? You're correct, that is not a shape. That is in fact the number 45. this that's correct 114 well done what number is this exactly 427 Is this? That's correct. That's the number eight. Yep. Well, you passed that cognitive test. So, what will happen now is I will assess the data after about a week. I will uh, come to conclusions based purely on the data. example watch a video and it's a picture of a woman and you go into the video and I show up you will feel a level of disappointment um, you'll feel like you've been lied to and this may cause you to click off the video I also have to take several other factors into consideration such as such as, well, there are many factors. I don't know what any of the factors are, but there are many factors. Based on watch time, for example, you uh, may have a video recommended to less people because the watch time on a video is a mere 30 seconds. But if the watch time is the whole time for seven minutes, the video will be pushed out further. So realistically, it is not just about click-through rate. Because a click-through rate of 3.5% on a video that only has 78 views compared to a video that has a thousand views but only a 2% of brain rotted guinea pigs such as yourselves. So just going to write down your address. Do you have an email address or an actual home address? Both is fine. channel in a week, maybe two weeks, and there will be a new video entitled T-A-O-C-B, and that is uh, the art of clickbait, and that's what the video will be entitled. I will go through the data with you and share some answers that people have given so that can better understand how brain rot works. Um, so thank you for indulging me in my experiment. Um, please don't watch any of the other videos that have, you know, the
the same time amount. The last four basically don't watch them because this will ruin the experiment. Okay, I'm going to write down a few details for you. My name is Dr. S. Kyants. S. Kyants. The S stands for science. My name is Dr. Science Kyants. Okay. And the date, do you have the date on you? I don't know if I, I don't have a watch for the date. Okay, thank you. Okay. And if anyone asks you about this, you can't tell anyone about it. Keep it between us. This is a very secret organization. Too many people know about it. It may get back to, you know, the big guys, so to speak, and they'll shut down my whole operation. Okay, that's for you. You can take that. Um, and I hope to see you in a week, two weeks, for the follow-up and the uh, analysis.